going on everybody uh, today we're going to show you the difference between the four millimeter world heavyweight title and the two millimeter world heavyweight title mm, I was very excited about this day to come because when I got the two millimeter millimeter plate two years ago I thought that was as real as it got and then they started coming out with the four millimeter plate belts as any of you who are belt fans know so I'm really excited about that now I'm just going to show you some of the differences between the two so you can make a decision be like oh I want to get this one or no but yeah I got them all from wwshop.com let's take a look at them alrighty so here are the two, the two belts the top one is the two millimeter plates and the bottom one is the four millimeter plates so clearly as everyone's going to know like so you got the old two millimeter plates it's it's kind of thick whatever I'm just going to see if I can there you go, focus in on it. See, it's kind of thick. But then you get the new 4mm plates, and that's, it looks even like twice, over twice as thick. Of course, it's twice as thick, but it looks even more to me. But, um, yeah, so just a little bit of the, the uh, similarities and differences. As you can see, there's, it's, it's a little thicker here on the, on the detail, but nothing compared to the new one. It's way thicker. The belts are about literally they're the same size. Let me zoom in up on it. The uh, the letter etching is definitely deeper, which is nice on the new belt. So you can barely feel. I know you can't tell, but you can rub right across it and barely even feel it. But right here, you can definitely feel a difference, which I really like the detail. And that's the weight and the detail is what really sold me on this. Otherwise, I've just kept my other belt. But the, the closer I can get to realistic, the better. Um, but I'm not willing to go pay two thousand dollars. I'd rather pay four hundred bucks for a new belt as opposed to two thousand and go like super, super great. But um, yeah, as you can see, the old one's a little bit lighter. The new one's um, richer, darker yellow. Let's see. And what else is there? It's got the the snap belts, snap plates, buckles, whatever you want to call them. Looks like arm jacks. It looks like about the same here, the same over there. Now, one of the big differences is the back. As you can see, that's black. For the two millimeter old one, it's black, and the new one, it's the red. It looks like snake skin, which I know they had for a little bit. And as you look, even though it's almost done with 2014, they have where is it at? Right there, I right, can't really see. It's just, there you go, it says 2013. So, I don't know why they're holding on to these for so long. I guess they're waiting to get rid of all the two millimeter plates. But, uh, yeah, I'm not really a big fan of the red. I might switch out the, the belt itself with the old one because I like, I like the black look as opposed to the red. And then another difference is when you get the two millimeter plates, they're just suit they're just flat as flat as heck like there it touches the ground but but since it's only two millimeters you can bend it and that it added a nice little curved mind to wrap around the body so you can adjust it a lot better but sorry there's my finger in case anybody want to look at it this is how you get the four millimeter plate it's got a bit of curve to it but not a lot and the thing is you can't really adjust that because it's so thick it to be like Superman or something to bend it to make it where you want, so that is a disadvantage. You gotta find my local Gold's Gym and find somebody to see if they can help bend it for me or something. But uh, yeah, as the the WCW four millimeter plate comes completely flat as opposed to that little bit of curve. You can't really see too well, but the other one would just be flat across the ground. But yeah, there's there's not a lot of differences, but. There's enough for I spent an extra 300 and something bucks just to get this belt. Now I just gotta find a new home for the old belt because I don't need two of them. But yeah, let's see. Hit me up. If you got any questions? Let me know. Let's see. I'm gonna go put them on the shelf and see what they look like there. So as you can see, this is where the new World Heavyweight Title belt is, sitting atop of the other belts on the rack. Right down there, the rest of my belts, and there you have the two millimeter plate belt, the old one, sitting all by itself, wanting a new home. 
with or without the Triple H title in play. Alrighty.